We all are loving the mass dancer, of course, the spinoff of the mass singer. Yes, and joining us now is one of the judges, Brian Austin Green. Hello, Brian. Hello. Good to see you, man. Hey, you were doing oh, some guys. like uh, that was some like detective work yeah. the way you were breaking down <laughs> the performer yeah, right there, yeah. man. I mean, obviously, there's a uh, there's a pretty high bar for me thinking, uh, guessing it, that it was pink <laughs> since it was a pink song. It's not. Uh, <laughs> It doesn't, doesn't seem like I, I did much investigative work at all, actually, when you when you watch that more than once. Well, I love, because you're friends with Robin Thicke, who, of course, is a, um, a judge on The Masked Singer. Do you guys, are you competitive at all at, like, what kind of judge you're going to be on these shows? No, not at all. Robin's terrible on his show, <laughs> and I'm terrible on mine. Um, so, there, it's, I, I think the only competition now is to see who's worse. <laughs> Um, which is fine with me. He lives down the street, and it's, you know, as long as, honestly, as long as we're entertaining people, that, that's, that's, that's our goal with it. That's his goal. That's my goal. Um, and I think this is the right time. This is the right time for it. No, that's all that matters. And I, uh, coincidentally, you were the giraffe, the giraffe. on The mass Singer. Uh, and now that... Was that's right, you were the giraffe, and then you transitioned to the mass dancer, and you're uh, on a panel along with Paul Abdul, Ken Jung, and Ashley Tisdale. That's a fun group right there. You having a good time, man? Yeah, it's really fun. It's really, um, at, at first, the, the concept and the whole thing seems kind of insane. I wasn't sure how the show would work and how we'd be able to figure out who, who was in these costumes, but it's, it's tons of fun. What, being uh, being a panelist on the show is amazing. The panel is amazing. Ken and Ashley and Paula and Craig. It, it's really a fun experience. It's probably the most fun I've had working uh, since I started working. And I've been doing this a long time. You know, Mario. Oh, yeah. We've been here for a while. We've been here a minute. Yeah. <laughs> hey, but I love the pivot and all the great work that you're doing. Of all of the judges, I know you get along with all of them, but who are you sort of bonding with the most? Um, what? that's a hard, that's a hard one to answer. Um, I'm bonding with everyone in a totally different way. At, at first I was, I was bonding really well with Ken because, uh, he's hysterical and how can you not? And, uh, and he was, it was really fun doing singer and, and, and working with him because he spoke so much and I couldn't speak at all. So we, we developed sort of an interesting bond in, in speaking and not speaking and, and dragging stuff out and me being really hot in the costume. <laughs> um, so it was, it was sort of a fun thing that, that, that we had built there. But um, the panel, I mean, everybody involved is really fun. I have a great connection with Paula, which uh, I was a bit intimidated by her at yes. first. I mean, she's been famous as long as I can remember. And so when I met her, and she is the sweetest person in the world. Yeah. She's so cool. Uh, Ashley's amazing. Craig is great. I had met Craig before briefly for like 15 seconds at the premiere of the first um, Ninja Turtles film. He was sitting behind me, and I, I turned around like like we do in, in Hollywood, like, you know, we knew each other. <laughs> it's like, hey, how you doing, man? He was like, I'm good. And that was all we said. <laughs> like, that, was, that was the whole exchange. It was really, it was really in depth. I heard Craig made up a I heard he made up a jingle for you. Is that true? And if Let's so, what it. is it? Yeah, so he um, he's super musical. Yeah. And Brian Austin Green apparently has a ring to it to him. So he started singing Brian Austin Green. <laughs> and he does it all the time, just randomly yeah. uh, on the microphone. Like just walking around, getting touch-ups, doing whatever, and that's that's sort of been his uh, his his thing. He sounds a little like me. Jason Derulo with that. Right? <laughs> <laughs> a little Jason Derulo-ish. Okay. That needs to be oh, your oh, ringtone. Oh, that's it. <laughs> yeah. uh, well, we love seeing that you had such a great vacation. Aloha to Hawaii. Tell us about you and Sharna. We're so glad that you found some love. Yeah, it's uh, we had a great time. We had a really good time. It was Hawaii is an amazing place, um, and uh, it, it's all it's all going really well right now. I mean, you know, it's 
it's early on, so uh, we don't have any labels for, for anything, obviously, but uh, we're really enjoying each other's company. You, you she's, she's an amazing woman. She's super responsible, and uh, she's super sweet and caring and passionate. It's fun to be around, so I'm, I feel blessed right now. Brian, you weren't on Dancing. Were you? How'd y'all meet? No, so we we have the same uh, business manager. Ah. And so, oh, there's my rooster. Look at, listen, did you oh, hear that? I didn't. Wait, you got a rooster? Go oh. get him. I, yeah, I built a chicken coop during the summer. <laughs> didn't everyone? <laughs> Wasn't that like the normal pastime was building Gosh. chicken coops? Um, so yeah, get, so I have a rooster. You get fresh um, eggs? So, <laughs> I do get fresh. I get like five fresh eggs every day. That's it's awesome. unbelievable. Those taste awesome. It's by so way. cool. Yeah, it's so cool <laughs> with kids to be able to just like eat eggs and then not have to go to the grocery store ever. Like you just go out the next morning and there's more. Magically. You just I love that you're <laughs> handy <laughs> like that. That's so cool. I didn't know you were so handy. Yeah, I I didn't either. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's, am it's amazing what quarantine brings out of people. Okay, wait, back to how you and Sharna got connected. Yeah, so we have the same, I like how you brought that back around. <laughs> the, business, the business manager. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so we have the same business manager, and, uh, and, and she was like, hey, I've got a client that you should meet. And um, I was kind of in a place of like, you know, okay. Like I begrudgingly went, and, uh, and, and we met, and, and we had great conversation. So it's been, it's been great so far. Good for you, man. You I know, that's, that. a, that's a good lesson to, you know, be open. Yeah. You know, if somebody wants to say to you, I think you should be open, you never know. Has she always been a fan of yours? Does she go way back to 90210 when we all first fell in love with you? No, she, uh, I, 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 I haven't actually asked her um, why she didn't watch it, but I know she didn't watch much of it <laughs> when she was younger. Does she sing the Brian Austin yeah, Green she's song? She's watching Mario. She's watching, uh, um, watching this show. <laughs> so she's got impeccable taste. <laughs> she has, exactly. <laughs> Fair enough, man. Hey, well, congratulations on everything, yes. including your chickens. We love the roosters. And, uh, next, next time, hey, next time we see you in person, I want uh, at least a dozen eggs, please. Some fresh eggs when you're coming in, player. Since you took uh, my I'll Halloween costume, he took remember your you took Kai. my Halloween, you took my Cobra Kai costume, so I want some eggs in return, please. Wait, and y'all okay. were Cobra Kai before it was cool. Yep. <laughs> awesome. I sent Mario a picture in the, in I the costume. This I need it. It looked great. It looked great. Well, congrats, man. And listen, check out Brian. The Masked Dancer airs on Wednesdays on Fox at 8, 7 central.